Well, you know this, our, straight, our state is no stranger to good cheese, but a Greene County dairy is trying its hand at another milk made product. News 3's Danica Lewis shows just how these cheesemakers by trade are breaking into a new expanding market, Danica. Well, guys, I hope you brought your spoons today <laughs> because this is a bit of a culture shock for Southern Wisconsin. Klondike Cheese Company is jumping into one of the latest health food trends and boy, it's quite the endeavor. <laughs> Just having the, the dairy experience, you know, a lot of things carry over. Water, water everywhere, but not a cup to eat. Well, not yet. Our cheese background definitely helps us a lot, but there is a little bit of a learning curve for us for the Greek yogurt. The factory is far from finished, but these men and machines are making Adam Buholzer's dairy dream a reality. We'll have strawberry, blueberry, uh, peach, raspberry, vanilla, and black cherry. Those flavors start in silos. Milk is skimmed down, separated, and finally fermented, a process that employs a bit of kitchen chemistry. With yogurt, you actually then go into a long hold tube because you want to denature the whey proteins. The fourth generation family business knows it's cheese, but being Swiss, they wanted an authentic touch. We do have a Greek, a Greek yogurt maker. With that expertise, Buholzer wants to turn out custom orders by the barrel, mostly for food services. You know, this is actually the, the pasteurizer in the corner. And breaking into the yogurt business is not cheap. Klondike spent $12 million on the project. That includes the high-tech production line. Just consistency, you know, that you do the same thing day in and day out to have the ultimate same product every day. Once the equipment is in, this space is where cups will be filled with the protein packed snack. For now, a test batch is all there is to taste. But where there's a will, sometimes there's curds and some whey. So just the fact that she finally been making yogurt is very exciting. Now, if you've never had it, what makes it Greek? Well, Bullhoser said the thick consistency, high protein content, and that tangy flavor are some of the most distinguishable traits. Glondike can turn out 18 million pounds of yogurt a year, and there's room to double that amount. You can expect to see the first cups of Odyssey yogurt hit the shelves in June. Big investment, and that's uh, that Greek yogurt. That's all the rage these days. That's People are the thing. About yeah, I guess uh, you got to get a foot in the door somehow. So Danica brought us none back. <laughs> yeah, we've been oh, meaning to talk to her about that. You called me out on it. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Good Danica. Story, no problem.